Okay. Number one question is minus five x plus four minus two x less than ten minus nine x plus four. Uh, combine lighter is negative five x and negative two x is negative seven x plus four the less time and the right hand side we have ten and four is fourteen fourteen minus nine x after that a moving a return can contain x to the left 7x plus 9x less than 14 is the e minus 4 now I combine like turn again this is 2x less than 14 minus 4 is 10 divided by 2 x is less than uh, <clears throat> the representation of this idea graphically is, I suppose, all written over here. This is infinity, this is negative infinity, this is zero here in the middle. One, two, three, four, and five, positive five. Now, <coughs> is less than, see it's less than, is to the left, a U shade or highlight this bar. And of course, do not include a file, because we don't see here equal. Now, this idea is present, an in interval notation is from negative infinity comma phi parenthesis parenthesis okay, this corresponds with the option C okay the second question is about compound inequality uh, uh, maybe it's intersection or union in this case it's intersection because it's a so basically this is over a number line this is infinity positive, infinity negative. We have zero here in the middle. Positive two is here. One, two. And negative four is negative one, negative two, negative three, and negative four here. Okay, now <coughs> is a value is a defined both condition is less than negative two less than negative 2 means to the left less than and also is greater than or equal to negative 4 is in the other direction so to the right because it's greater than and the intersection is the common part the common part in between is obvious is this bar is the bar in between negative 4 and positive 2 of course including negative 4 because we see here equal and do not include it 2 because you don't see here equal and this answer corresponded with the auction in interval notation you write like that bracket negative four comma two parentheses okay number three question is equation that contain actual value so you copy you copy you copy the right hand side the left hand side twice
on the right hand side you could be again positive or negative and you could be negative to be with four minus two and you're solving completely separately both equations in this case in order to eliminate the fraction the least common denominator is four multiply the whole thing by four multiply by four by four by four and by four uh -huh. when you multiply by four this is two m because four divided by two is two plus eight four times two is eight is equal cancels out four at least four is three m minus eight again four times two is eight now solve for m 2m minus 3m is equal negative 8 minus negative 8. This is negative 1m is equal negative 16. Divided by negative 1 both sides and it's positive 16. This is one solution. Another solution you multiply whole thing by negative 1. Distribute the property here. Multiplication is one half m plus two is equal minus I forgot n here uh, three over four m plus plus two this negative multiplied by negative spot now again the L C D is four I multiply by four whole thing four 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 and four again is 2m plus 8 but in this case minus 3m cancels out 4 and 4 plus 8 okay again moving 2m plus 3m is equal a minus 8 5m equal to 0 divided by 5 both sides m is equal 0 divided by 5 is 0. then the solution set is solution set is 16 and 0 okay, corresponding with the option A mm -hmm. okay number 4 is inequality that contain actual value but in this case is case 2 because I saw case greater than I remember in case 2 you separate the problem in two problems you copy the expression inside the bar twice and this expression must be greater than or equal 3 or less than or equal negative 3 and you're connecting both inequality by or and you form a compound inequality and let's solve being completely separately okay let's solve the first part is minus x is greater than or equal 3 minus 3 minus x is greater than or equal 0 part by negative 1 by negative one positive x is less than or equal zero because zero divided by any number is zero always mm -hmm. now the second is minus x is less than or equal minus three minus three minus x is less than or equal minus six divided by negative one again x is greater than or equal positive 6 okay now let's see the solution the solution so far is x x uh, less than or equal 0 or x greater than or equal 6 mm -hmm. now let's do in the graphic the graphic is number 
infinity, negative infinity, this is zero. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Let the value we can satisfy the following condition. Less than or equal to zero. Less than is to the to the left. Including zero. Bracket here. And greater than or equal six. Greater than or equal six is include six is to the right. Okay, now when you shade that, include everything. As I include this part. Bracket here, bracket here, include this part. And continue forever in what direction? Off direction. Now the solution is the first piece is from negative infinity, comma zero, parenthesis, bracket union, bracket six, comma infinity. Mm, can correspond with the option, let me see. The option, the option B. It's obvious that the option B.